Let's try build a barbecue out of some pots, shall we? Should we turn these into a barbecue pig? There are slugs on them, so I want to make sure that the dog doesn't get near the slugs. That's a consideration. Uh, you also don't want to eat slugs because they'll, they'll kill you. So when you make pottery, you have to bake it, which means that it's probably fire resistant, I reckon. I'm just going to drill some holes in it so the barbecue's got oxygen so it can get good and hot. I've just started these charcoals on the stove top until they were red hot. I'm just going to cut this steel mesh to make a, a grill plate. I'll probably put tin foil on the chicken so as it doesn't have to touch this rusty metal. I'm just going to cook some jerk chicken in this. I'll link to that recipe below. With jerk chicken, you really want to get red hot charcoals. That char is a big part of the flavor. Just going to leave that for like half an hour before I test it. Use a digital thermometer to check the temperature inside the chicken. So it's been like 45 minutes, so it's probably good to go. Just use a bit of steel to take the lid off, so I don't have to touch it with my hands. It's worked really well. I think next time I would probably, probably get the charcoals way hotter before I put it in, and maybe get a better steel grate so that I can get some char on them without touching that rusty steel. Overnight, the, the clay hot cracked so it turns out that they're not fire resistant this isn't, isn't a long-term solution it does barbecue but it's not a long-term solution to your barbecuing uh, needs 